Hi kids, welcome to our class. Okay, today we will learn new topic that is has got I've got which is in your year three textbook unit one welcome page five. Are you ready kids? Okay. When do we use has got and have got? What is has got and have got? Yeah, we will use has got or have got to uh, possess something. It means you are own something. Okay, when you own something, you will use has got, have got. You are having it. For example, car, a pencil, a big family. Okay, so I've got a car. Okay, look at this picture. So this girl got a car, right? So I've got a car. So when you having something you will use has got or have got or another thing you can use to describe something about about a thing about an object when you want to describe you will use has got or have got for example she has got a blonde hair uh, when she has a got a blonde hair you will use has got or have got uh, for example uh, the elephant has got a long trunk Okay, so when it has something to describe something, you can use has got or have got. Okay, when do we use have got and has got? Okay, so I, you, we, they. Okay, I and you are special characters. We and they for uh, plural pronouns, we will use have got. Okay, so when he, she, he, it. For singular pronouns, we will use has got. For example, I have got brown eyes. Okay, look, I. So, I have got brown eyes. Okay, you can write like this also. I have got brown eyes. So, when I apostrophe VE, it means I've got brown eyes. So, you may write in these both forms. Okay, anything. You can write I have got brown eyes. Or you can write like this short form. I've got brown eyes. Both will be accepted. Okay. So we have got brown eyes. They have got brown eyes. You may write like this. Okay. So for he, she, it singular pronouns we will use has got. Uh, for example, he has got an apple. Okay. You may write like this also. He has got an apple. So, he's got an apple. You can write in both form. He has got or he's got an apple. Okay, class. So, you may use all this for he, she and it. It, we refer to non-living things. Okay. So, whenever you see a cat, a plant, you may use it. Okay. Next. Let us do a complete overview on this has got and have got. Look, he has got a blue tie. He's got a blue tie. Both will be accepted. He has got three years. It's got three years. Okay, the next one. Ah, look at this. She, so one person. She has got. She has got heavy bags. Singular pronouns. I have got long hair. I've got long hair. Next. You have got a dog. You've got a dog. Okay. I and you, you will use have got. We have got a nice house. We. Uh, plural pronouns. So, have got uh, they have got green eyes they've got green eyes uh, both so plural so we use have got okay class okay let us go for exercise now okay so we do a little exercise oral exercise okay to make more understanding okay look here we black hair so we is a lot of people plural so we have got black hair okay andre's sister okay andre's sister one person or many one andre's sister is one so i've got has got it will be has got a camera okay andre's sister as 
got a camera okay our dog so our dog it refers to one dog so one dog means singular pronouns it will be has got okay i now i I is a special character. So what will we have? I a new computer. I have a got a new computer. Okay, Katie. Katie is a singular pronoun. So Katie a big kai. Katie has got a big kai. Okay. Now look at this. That's cool. A big garden. Okay, that's cool. So what have we done, sir? Yes, that's cool. One. So has got a big garden. Andre and Daniel, blue eyes. Got two people there. Plural pronouns. So it will be. It will be have got. Andre and Daniel have got blue eyes. Okay, my mother a car. My mother. So have got or has got one people? Yes, has got a car. Those children, those children, toy cars. Those means many. So a lot. It will be have got toy cars. Okay. Now let's try this. Peter a good job. Peter one or many one. So has got a good job. My uncle three. Daughters. So we will refer to the uncle here. Okay, my uncle. So one people or many. Ah, uh, don't look at the three daughters. Just look at the subject. The subject is one. My uncle. So it will be has got. Okay, my uncle has got three daughters. Okay. Okay, that's all for today's class. I hope all of you all understand today's lesson. Okay, that's all for today. Thank you. Bye-bye.